my friends welcome to a new episode of the dean's list where if you can fish for your viewing pleasure it's monday my friends it's a good day god made it we're out here you know it so what are we doing today you ask right i'm here to answer my friends we're doing more paco la fuente babe we love this stuff these needle fish were so good we had to try the small sardines in olive oil so today we do small sardines and olive oil. I love this net. I don't know if that's because I'm a VIP member. They know who the Dean's List is. Did they just give me a piece of the net? Or maybe if you order one, you get a piece of the net too. You'll have to find out yourself, my friends. You know what I mean? But hey, we're out here. So that's that. I'm expecting good things from this can. So, um... Here we go, right? Here we go. Of course, the sun comes out like as soon as, you know, it's the rainiest day in the world. Now the sun's going to come out. It's okay. It's okay. We need some sun. We need some sun. So here we go. Booyah. Excited. All that tuna last week, my friends. Got to get the calcium levels up. How did he? Oh, I bet you these look nice, my friends. Look at those. Oh, there's some sweet looking deans. I'm excited. I'm excited, you know, that was a lot of tuna last week, my friends, hopefully you kept up, oh, these are some very nice fish, my friends, Let's see if we can hold this guy up for the camera a little, right, let's see, I'm just gonna hold him, hopefully I don't, let's see, can we see him, yeah, he looks pretty good, man, this is a nice looking sardine, my friend, it's a nice looking sardine, bismillah, Ooh. These have good texture, my friends. I like that. I, I often wonder, I don't know if this comes down to the cooking process, but some have just really nice texture on them. These have really nice texture on them. These are nice. I had a good feeling about Paco La Fuente. Especially after that needle fish. But, um, yeah. This is definitely a brand I would endorse, man. The other stuff they sell is like cockles and brine. I don't even know what cockles are, my friend. So you probably won't be seeing cockles on the channel. I'm not much of a shellfish person, my friends. If it comes in a shell, to me... Usually it's like an almond or a cashew, a walnut maybe, but I don't really, you know, lobsters and crabs and I'll eat crab cake or something, but these are good sardines, my friends. This can is actually, I think, a dollar more than the needle fish. So about a $10 can. I think the needle fish were nine, but these are definitely good. These are definitely good. Nice little guys. Medium sized pilchard. All the good things. Looks like, I don't know. I would say about 12 to 15 fish in this can. But hey, man, that's 12 to 15 athletes we're eating, right? My friends, I just stopped at Walmart up the street. Because it's a busy one. And I saw they had like King Oscar salmon, my friends. I didn't know they had this. So I'm going to try this at some point soon on the channel. Only about four bucks a, a tin. So fair, fair and reasonable. Very cool. So yeah, I got a couple things. But that's the only one I'll show you right now. The rest will have to be a surprise, my friends. Man. These are good sardines, my friends. Paco La Fuente, dude. And I just love that net. Like, if I was going to go somewhere fancy, I'd probably bring a tin of Paco La Fuente just because it looks so nice, you know? Other than that, I don't know. What else are you going to bring? I don't know. Ramon Pena's. They're fancy. Oh, I went and saw a cover band this week on my friends. It was good, but it was, 
a little more mature than I thought. It was all like 60s, 70s covers. And the crowd was definitely people who would like 60s and 70s covers. And I was like a toddler in there. I was like the youngest guy in the room. But we're not mad. It was a good time. Hand out a couple Dean's List pens. And that's what it's about, my friends. That's what it's about. You know? Not every day is going to be like all-star whatever. We got to keep pushing. We got to keep pushing. I feel my calcium levels coming back up already, my friends. I even ate a can of uh, King Oscar, the jalapeno ones last night. Just because, just because. And King Oscar is good, man. You just need Deans in your life? Get you some King Oscar. Well, you want fancy, man. Get you Paco La Fuente, bro. Get you Paco La Fuente. These are very good fish. Very nice looking fish. Definitely nicer than some of the other ones I see. Skin very intact. Very silvery. This overall, this is a delight, this tin. I would say this tin is a delight, my friends. That was a good Monday, man. We don't even need no crackers. We don't need no hot sauce. That's how you know they're good fish. You know? I mean, the crackers and hot sauce are good, whatever. But, no, these are nice fish. This guy's fat, dude. I'm a big chunker. We love it. Man, I'm so high on Omega-3s, my friends. What are you doing? I'm not sure what I should do next, you know? Now that we got the pens, the bullet train idea, maybe I have to do coffee mugs, or maybe baseball hats, because I feel like people would like to have a baseball hat with a fish on it. I don't wear baseball hats, but I know a lot of people do. So maybe we'll do that. Let's see, let me, let me rock this can. We only got three fish left, my friends. There's two down. Oh, and this little guy, he was just hiding. I see it, my friend. Paco La Fuente, dude. These guys, they're serious, dude. They're serious. They love fish as much as I love fish. Probably more. Because they put a lot of work into the presentation and the fish itself. So, great endorsement from Paco La Fuente. You know you're going to be seeing Deans this week after Tuna Week last week, my friend. So, stay strong. Stay up. Stay tuned in. And, uh... We'll be here for your Omega-3s, my friends, all right? Peace.